hot day. The sun is shining. It is a very hot day. What a lovely hot day. <laughs> Pepper and George are wearing their boots. They are going to jump in muddy puddles. I love muddy puddles. Never mind, Pepper. It's so sunny, you can play in the paddling pool instead. Yes, the paddling pool. <laughs> Pepper and George are wearing their swimming costumes. Mummy Pig is wearing her swimming costume. And Daddy Pig is wearing his swimming costume. Because it's so hot, you need sun cream. Yes, we all need sun cream today. Oh. <laughs> Daddy Pig is pumping up the paddling pool. <laughs> Easy as pie. <laughs> Pepper and George love their paddling pool. I suppose it is an especially hot day. Hooray! <laughs> Please, can I have one as well? Everyone likes ice cream. Hello, Mummy Pig, Pepper and George. Hello, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and what would young Mr. George like? Dinosaur. A dinosaur? Silly George. He always says dinosaur for everything. Well? Dinosaur. George loves his dinosaur ice lolly so much he doesn't want to eat it. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. Enjoy the weather. <laughs> George, I really think you should eat your ice lolly before it melts and... It is so warm, Daddy Pig has fallen asleep. Daddy Pig does look hot. Let's dip water on Daddy to cool him down. Good idea, Pepper. <laughs> Quick, George, let's get our boots. <laughs> Pepper and George are wearing their boots. Mr. Skinny Legs. Pepper is playing with her doll's house. George is playing too. George is putting the dolls to bed. Night, night. George, why are you putting the children to bed? George isn't listening. He's too busy putting the dolls to bed. George, if you want to play with my doll's house, you have to help with the tea party. Mummy, we're coming. <laughs> George is going to fill the teapot with water. George likes the spider. <laughs> the spider likes George. Oh, I'm sorry, Mummy. I must have eaten them all. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Naughty Daddy. There's no need to be afraid, Pepper. Spiders are very, very small, and they can't hurt you. But don't worry. Daddy will take it out of the bedroom. Whoa! He likes being in my doll's house. Hello, children. I hear you found a little spider. I'll take him out of the bedroom so you two can play. <laughs> night, night. George is putting the spider to bed. No, George! He wants some tea. He doesn't want to be in bed. We are all going to have tea with Mr. Skinny Legs. Who wants tea? Me, please. Me, please. Hello, Mr. Daddy Pig. Hey, uh, that's all right, Peppa. Let Mr. Skinny Legs drink his tea. You're not scared, are you, Daddy? Oh, no. Of course not. Well, <laughs> not so... <laughs> Pepper likes Mr. Skinny Legs. Everyone likes Mr. Skinny Legs. Lunch. Pepper and George have come to Granny Pig and Grandpa Pig's house for lunch. <laughs> Grandpa Pig! Papa Egg! Hello, Pepper, George. This oh. 
Let's chew some vegetables for lunch. <laughs> Pepper. Oh dear. Do you both like lettuce? Yes, Grandpa. Do you like cucumber? Yuck. George does not like cucumbers, and he does not like lettuce, and he does not like tomatoes. Well, George, what vegetable do you like? <laughs> oh, lovely fresh tomatoes, lettuce and cucumber. Granny Pig has made the tomatoes, lettuce and cucumber into a salad. Grandpa Pig, can you call everyone to lunch? Tuck in, everyone! George, just try a little bit of this lovely tomato. Yuck! George, this is cucumber. Grandpa Pig grew it in his garden. Look what I'm doing. Now it's a dinosaur. A dinosaur. <laughs> so. George, are you too full to eat any more tomatoes, lettuce or cucumber? George is too full to eat any more. Chocolate cake! <laughs> My word! George seems to have got his appetite. The Sleepy Princess. It is night time. Pepper and George are going to bed. Could I have a story? But maybe George is sleepy and doesn't want a story. George, do you want a story? Say yes. <coughs> hmm. I think I'll tell you the story of the Sleepy Princess. Is it a good story? Is there a little princess in the story, Daddy? Oh, <laughs> yes. There is a little princess in it. <coughs> in a castle, there lived a little princess. And she was called the Sleepy Princess. Daddy, why was she called that? Who else was living at the castle? Uh, well... The others in the castle were the small prince, <coughs> queen... Like me. <laughs> anyway, there was also a dragon. Dinosaur! A dinosaur? <coughs> oh dear, maybe the dinosaur wasn't quite that fierce, Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig! Oh, sorry. I was being the dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, why is the princess called the sleep? <sighs> but the most sleepy of all... But somebody is. George, wake up! You'll miss the end of the story. <laughs> well, Peppa might not be sleepy. Good night. The sleepy princess was so sleepy, she had fallen fast asleep. The museum. Pepper and her family are going to the museum. Even older than me. Ooh, really old. <laughs> <laughs> There's one room full of things that belong to kings and queens from long ago. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mummy Pig. Hello, Miss Rabbit. How many tickets, please? Two adults and two children. Dinosaur? But George wants to see the real dinosaur. <laughs> Don't worry, George. We will see the dinosaur next. <laughs> this is the Queen's dress. It's so pretty. Look, Pepper. this is the Queen's golden crown. Wow! But they did have computers. No, they didn't have computers either. What did they do all day? Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> delicious. Is there anything else you would care for, Queen Pepper? Yes, more cake, please. 
You must bow when you speak to me. Oh, I'm most terribly sorry, Your Royal Highness. And what do you do? I'm your daddy. The dinosaur room? George, this is the dinosaur room. <laughs> dinosaur! Where is the dinosaur? He's somewhere in the room. I can't see him. He must be very small. <laughs> dinosaur! <laughs> George imagines being a big dinosaur. <laughs> the dinosaur room is George's favourite room. The room with the cakes in. Daddy Pig's favourite room is the museum cafe. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, tuck in. Oh, yes. This is a very nice room. <laughs> <laughs> Secrets. <coughs> Mummy Pig has made a special box for Pepper. Pepper, it's your secret box. <coughs> I know what I can put in it. Good, but don't tell me. <coughs> I won't tell you or George or Daddy. It died. <laughs> George wants to help Pepper. <coughs> no, George. Only I must know what's in the box. You have to wait outside while I choose. George, you must not look inside. George would like to know what is inside Pepper's secret box. If you like, you can try to guess. <coughs> anyway, a dinosaur is too big to fit in the box. George cannot guess what is in Pepper's secret box. Right. Can I have a try? Yes. Hmm. Have you put my glasses inside? No! Pepper likes secrets. Bobby, no one knows what's in my box. Oh, what else? No. George's toy dinosaur is not in George's box. <laughs> it's too difficult. I'll never guess. On the count of three, you each show what's in your boxes. Ready? Yes. One... Two, three. George has a custard donut. Oh. But Pepper's box is empty. I've got nothing else. But I know a very good place to hide my custard donut. Can you guess where? Hmm. Are you going to hide it in? <laughs> I'm going to hide mine in my tummy. Me too. <laughs> 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 it is a lovely sunny day. <laughs> Pepper and George are having a picnic. And what do you say? Grrr. You're very welcome, Mr. Dinosaur. <laughs> Would Teddy or Mr. Dinosaur like a cookie? <laughs> what was that strange noise? Pepper! George! It means there will be a thunderstorm with lots of rain. Quick, into the house before the rain starts. <laughs> no need to panic. The rain is still a long way off. Dinosaur. Good. Mr. Dinosaur is safe. Teddy! I left Teddy in the garden. He'll get wet. Don't worry, Pepper. Daddy Pig will rescue. Plenty of time before it rains. <laughs> There you are, Teddy. All dry. <laughs> ah, chill. What about poor Daddy? I'm soaking wet too. The rain is coming in the house. The floor is getting wet. Oh dear. What can we do, Daddy Pig? Quick, find something else to catch the water. Well done, Pepper. Easy as pie. Let's count between each flash and bang. The higher we can count, the further away the thunderstorm is. One, two... That's five! The thunderstorm is going away. 
They make muddy puddles. Fish, splash, splash, fish. Picky in the middle. <laughs> You're getting it all wrong. This is how to catch a ball. That's what you do. What a cheeky little one Pepper is. <laughs> Maybe Pepper is teasing George just a bit too much. Pepper, you take the ball and stand over there, and George, you stand over there. Good. You have to throw the ball to each other. George has caught the ball. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> well done, George. Now you throw the ball to Pepper. Come on, George, give the ball to me. <laughs> <laughs> Silly George. <laughs> I've got the ball. Peppa, now it's your turn to be piggy. George, catch. George, catch. <laughs> catch the ball, George. <laughs> catch, George. <laughs> George, catch. <laughs> oh, dear. Peppa, you shouldn't tease George like that. Sorry, George. <laughs> What's all the noise? Catch it, George. Hooray! <laughs> That's not fair. Yes, it is. <laughs> to me, George. Catch, George. <laughs>